Prosecutors have filed charges against the man accused of opening fire inside of a Milwaukee police station. 23-year-old Darion Parker Bell is charged with first-degree intentional homicide after shooting at officers inside District 5 Friday afternoon. A CBS 58's Winnie Dorch is live outside that building right now with more. Winnie. Well, yeah, that's one count of attempted first-degree intentional homicide and seven counts of first-degree recklessly endangering safety. Now, his girlfriend says she's very upset about his decisions and she wishes he would have talked to someone before leaning towards violence. Police say 23-year-old Darion Parker Bell walked into the District 5 police station last Friday. The criminal complaint says he asked the officer behind the counter about the death of his friend. 20-year-old Keyshawn Thomas died in police custody there two days before. That officer told Parker Bell he didn't have any information and he couldn't share even if he did. This set Parker Bell off and he fired a shot into the ground. We wouldn't think he would do something like this. Darion is actually sweet and caring. He shot towards the officer and the counter area. Other people in the lobby tried to hide. We encourage our officers and the front staff to wear their vests because that is uh, optional, um, but also that we have extended it to our civilians. We have to understand this sh shooting situation harm more than just our officers. We have civilian staff who don't deserve that type of environment. Another officer came from under a work area behind the counter and fired three shots at Parker Bell. Parker Bell then ran out of the station. Police tracked him down. They say he continued to wave his gun. Police told him to drop it, but he refused. Officers shot at him, eventually taking him into custody. I just feel like it was an impulse decision. Like he, he didn't think before doing it. The criminal complaint also says Parker Bell told police Thomas' death pushed him over the edge. He's been surrounded by death and violence, and he wanted to end his own life by shooting at police officers. You know, everyone reached a breaking point. That was his breaking point. And I did reach out to the family. They refused to comment. Live from District 5, I'm Winnie Dorch, CBS 58 News.